Hello and welcome to how to create a template. Beginners have been asking me this question quite a lot in the last couple of days and weeks, so let me explain it very quickly. Templates are a great way of saving some clicks when you want to build the same structures in the same order and layout multiple times. So let us just make such a template. I select a T3 power generator and we are going to make a template that allows us to get a T3 power generator ringed by mass fabricators and capped on the corners by mass storages, just like that. So we just build the structures in the same order and layout as we want the template to access them when we use it in the actual game. And then we select these units and really only these units. And this button says save template and that's the one you want to be using. I won't use it now because I don't want to mess up the templates I already have. And as you can see this very same template I have already saved here. So I can just build this again and a single click is going to allow me to build all of that. So very useful. Keep in mind that if you have lower tech engineers compared to the tech level of the structures you're building, then this template is not going to be in the menu. So you can see this uses a T3 power generator and therefore it's not going to be in the template menu of a T2 engineer. But as long as you have a T3 engineer or ACU or support ACU, you have access to all of your templates in the menu and you can verify that you correctly created those. Now you can right click on those templates in this menu to rename them. And uh, usually it's not necessary to rename them because the main purpose of templates is to save time and you want to connect your template with uh, some hotkey and access these very quickly, like that for example. And that's why you typically don't have time to read the name of the template, which is why the renaming feature doesn't make much sense. But perhaps you are a single uh, player who uh, would like to read these template names and uh, you may have some reason to add these names. And uh, let me teach you how to display the template names. So you press F10 and uh, then you click on options. And I have two screens, which is why part of the menu is going to be cut off, sorry for that, but you click on interface and you scroll down just a little bit. And here it says visible template names and you're going to switch this to on and after you've done that you can see the template names in this menu and it's going to say for example fabricators and power storage or something like that. You can just name it anything you want. And sometimes and these names are going to appear as pixelated. So this is not pixelated at all, but sometimes it can happen that this is pixelated. And if it is pixelated, then you just add an extra space character in here, like that, for example. And this is how you can fix it visually. And another option is if you have these templates, you can change the icon as well right if you click this button you can select the icons in here and this is a useful feature for people who use the quick template ui mod i'm going to make a separate video on this ui mod so if you are watching this video on the date of its release then this is not going to be in the description yet please stay tuned for more updates but if you are watching this video on a later date then you can just click on the link in the description and watch the video on quick template, which is a very great UI mod. And please keep in mind that the game is not only going to memorize the order at which you build the structures within the same template, in this case, power generator first, and then clockwise adding the ring, as we did before, but it also memorizes the order at which you create these templates and add them to the menu. So, you want to make sure 
that the most used stuff is going to be at the front of the quick selection. So the default hotkey for the quick selection of template is G and uh, perhaps you need to bind it by pressing F1 and scrolling down to the hot build part of the F1 menu. And after you've done that, you can press G to select those templates and whatever is most used should be at the front. Since I typically play team games on the air slot, my most used template is uh, going to be the mass storage template. For land players, the most used template is probably going to be the point defense. And regardless of the specific layout, if your point defense template in the wall segments around them, whether it's eight of them or four of them or five of them or whatever, you uh, are probably going to want to have this first as a land player and as a ladder player. So make sure that the quick selection of templates is going to appear in some reasonable order, depending on how often you use the stuff. And especially the T1 stuff, mass storages and power defense should be way at the front. And this also sort of poses the question, which templates are actually going to be useful to get and uh, which templates are not so great. Some people have tons of templates and uh, most of them are just adding too much stuff to the template menu that is not going to be used in the actual game. But uh, some people have very streamlined templates and only use the ones they really need. And which templates you should get is going to be a question I answer in an upcoming video. If you watch this at the release date, then the video is not going to be up yet. If you watch it at any later point, it is going to be in the description of this video and you can just click the link and watch that too. So I hope this clarified all your questions about templates and good luck, have fun in your games.